Ooh. <laughs> Did you see how he sniggered? <laughs> He said, huh. <laughs> What you got? What you got? All right, so I need to come back this way. But first, I need to find that. Um, 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 um. <laughs> Dang it. Sometimes I just can't remember words. Bubble. What's... What's this? Ah. Uh, something's got to give. <laughs> Goodbye, shield of the mind's eye. Shock me, isn't it? Let's see this one. Darn it. Yeah, yeah, off in the space. Darn it. <laughs> nice shot. That's a wonderful. It's gonna scatter everywhere, you're right. What's this? Mm. Weapon, 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 weapon. What's this? <laughs> different weapon, different weapon, different weapon. All right. Mm -hmm. Bubble, bubble. Who's got the bubble? Really? Hey there. Hey, guess what? Cool, I found a new combo. <laughs> Even and where's the bubble? Wow. Okay, that's weird. I can always come back. There's a shrine in there. I can just fly back whenever I want.
kaboom! it wouldn't be that easy. <laughs> Put it on the, on the ground. Going up. <laughs> okay, so we're using this one. <laughs> you think you're funny? So much more accurate now. Talus Hammer with an improved sneak strike. All right, uh, need to go back up. I'm <laughs> so mad. Hey, buddy. Uh. All right, so the pirates are on that ship, which means I'm going back in here.
I said loophole, but I'm actually very far away from the cape. So, no. I think it's time to do some more exploring in here. I know there's a bubble in here. Where it sets, I don't know. But I know it's here. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe there isn't a bubble in here. It's just a really large cave. So, oh. Oh, let's use this instead. Because of course. No, no, no. Let's use this instead. Ha! Ha ha! Almost gave up. Try to escape from me? How dare you! Where am I? Still over here, huh? Sticky lizard. Ooh. <laughs> I didn't know lizards could burrow. Oh, 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 okay. Ah, in the cover of night. Yeah. I should be high enough to or not. Oh boy. Okay. Whew. Let's go. What? Yeah. Okay. Now I'm definitely high enough and in the right position to ambush those pirates. my game face on. Time. Night time. That doesn't mean they'll be asleep. Luralin Village! Alright, you pirates. Freeze! Freeze! Freeze. I missed. Freeze. Yeah, doesn't count as a sneak strike. Shut up. Duh, ice cream. I didn't see you. Flame on. Uh, I said flame on. Yep, like that. Don't do that. Can I help you? Alaska. Uh, 
What you got? Ooh. What you got? <clears throat> Aw. Whoops. You're right. <laughs> Counterpoint. Looks like fun. Mind if I join in? Oops. Get rid of the pirate ship, but should have known that wouldn't be enough. Oh, okay. No one there. I see all of those. Some of them asleep. Um, all of those. Okay. Fine. Yeah, here we go. Over here. What you got? Where you going? Huh? Black Lazalfo's tail. Look at that fuse attack power. Highly flexible, stretchable tail. Fuse it with a weapon that adds a slashing whip like quality to attacks. Um, I kind of want to do that. But it can also be very useful as an elixir, so probably not. Roasted Porgy. Fishing Harpoon. Oh, wait. Uh, give me a sec. Hmm. Ah, good stuff. All right. Uh huh. Boom, 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 boom. Ha. Muddle Bud. Why don't you fight amongst yourselves? At least for a little while. Ah! They really did destroy everything. Used to be a nice little waterlogged fishing village. Wow, well, anyway. one. 
Hello. Ah. That was sure close. Thanks, Avatar Tuna. Whoops. Ah, that was sure close. Haha. <laughs> Hit him! Stop that. <laughs> now let's drop this and get this. There's a well. Muddle Bud. Shoot, you're the one I really want to hit with it. Ah, shoot. Mm. There we go. You guys fight amongst yourselves. Hey. Oh, yeah. There sure are a lot of you guys. Oh, you guys are still fighting? All right, well, you do that, yeah? You're not gonna hit me. So I don't know why you're even trying. Ooh! <laughs> Did you see how he sniggered? <laughs> Stop. He said, <laughs> what you got? What you got? Uh huh. <laughs> I guess the last of the monsters is what I left behind. You got worked on. <laughs> Sneaking. <laughs> Where's the last one? He doesn't see me. <laughs> These clothes are incredible. He didn't see me. Just one more. I'm gonna need to make myself a little more conspicuous now, because I do not know where he is. Is it in the well, perhaps? Maybe it's in the well. Eight ten a.m. No, um, no fear of it coming back to life. Of the monster forces coming back to life. I didn't do too badly. I 
got hit once or twice, but overall, not too bad. I'd say I'm not a novice, I'm more of a intermediate level. Yeah. And also, whatever monster is left is probably in that well. Yeah, all right, so here we go. Where did I see that well? It's not over here, right? Right. Yeah, it's over here. Yes. Fisherman shield. This light wooden construction makes it convenient. Take on a bow. Hi. Oh wow. You're a strong one. Mm. Ah what have I got? Uh, no, no, no. We're going to take you out with this. Bad, 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 bad. Hmm? I can't hear the monsters anymore. What? The monsters are gone? Oi! Rosal! Everyone! It's safe to come back now! That's right, your friendly neighborhood hero did the work. It can't be. Those horrible monsters are... They're all gone. Every last one of them. I, I saw everything from the house where I was hiding. You were still hiding in a house? I'm glad you're safe. <laughs> this lone warrior type showed up out of nowhere and took out every last monster in the village all by himself. Whoa, I knew it. Sure, you look like a strong breeze could blow you over, but you are solid as a stone. Knew it the moment I saw you. Bolson, you do remember me, right? Oh, thank you. We could do nothing but watch while monsters overran our village. If you hadn't shown up, our home might have been d damaged beyond repair. We owe you a great debt. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. The good news is not all of the houses have been destroyed. If we all work together, I'm sure we can rebuild. Mm -hmm. Don't you worry. I'll fix up all the houses the monsters destroyed. This kid's act of chivalry has lit a fire under me. I'm ready to get to work, baby. Oh. Bolson, you're only a visitor and yet... What can I say but thank you? Oh. I'm sorry, but I don't have anything I can give you as a reward. Not with our village in shambles. Of course, once the village is rebuilt, we'll be sure to show you just how warm our hospitality can be. Yes, I'm hopeful we can repay you for all you've done. One day. Eventually. <laughs> oh. Now listen, everyone. Lurlin Village has been, has been given a chance at a fresh start. If we all do our part, I know we can bring this baby back from the brink. So get ready, because old Bolson here is going to keep you busy until this village is rebuilt. Cool. Good. Nice. Awesome. Now we will definitely repay you. In the future. And maybe an installment? <laughs> now that the pirates are gone, even the air itself feels clean again, right? Truly, I can't thank you enough. Mm -hmm. The way you fought those pirates, it was incredible, awe-inspiring. And now that you've driven them out, it's my turn to get to work. Mm. Yes, the pirates may be gone, but that doesn't mean we can roll out the welcome mat yet. We have to do something about the state of the village, or no one will return home. Oh. Don't you worry. I might not look it, but I know a thing or two about construction. Besides, I owe you. No, I owe this whole village for taking me in. And I pay my debts. It's kind of my thing. Mm. Also, this village has char... 
charm. I can't wait to restore the village, the, the restaurant, and the lucky treasure shop to their former glory. Oh. Hmm. Materials might be an issue, though. See, I'm going to need a rather large amount of logs and Hylian rice. And since I want to use palm trees as central pillars in the buildings, the logs have to come from somewhere else. Uh, how can I help? Huh? What did you say? No, I, I appreciate the offer, but you've already done so much. You drove off those awful pirates after all. I couldn't ask an outsider to go to so much trouble for us. Oh. Now, now, if he's offering to help, who are we to say no? Mm -hmm. As of today, you and me are pals. And because we're pals, I'm going to let you help me. Now that that's decided, I'm going to briefly go over everything to, uh, on, to, on our to-do list. First, we're going to rebuild each destroyed building's foundation. Mm. So let's see. Yeah. I think you can collect 15 logs for me. That's what we'll need. And when I say logs, I don't mean ones from palm trees. I'm going to use those palm trees for something important. So get those logs from other trees, okay? Mm -hmm. Also, I'm going to need 20 bundles of Hylian rice to repair the thatched roofs uh, that were burned. Think you can handle that too? Oh. Thank you for everything. I won't be able to assist you myself. I'll be looking around and assessing the damage. Mama. I'm going to call this project the Great L uh, Luralin Village Revival. Our first collaboration. How exciting is that? <laughs> no pressure or anything, but I'll be counting on you. Hmm. Logs and rice. But I don't believe I have. Nope. I need to buy more rice. <laughs> I need a lot more rice than I thought I would. Now, by logs, do you mean wood? Or do you mean to do you mean for me to bring you logs? Cause that's going to be a hassle. A real hassle. Hmm. I guess my first order of business is to get rice to see if that's what he means. Iron shell crab. Oh. You who have conquered the shrines and claimed the lights of blessing. In exchange for four lights of blessing, I will amplify your being. So tell me what it is you desire. Your being overflows with vigor. There is no need to increase your stamina vessels further. Increase your heart containers. <laughs> he just put me over there. Yes. <laughs> I shall grant you the power you seek. I feel funny. Yay. Zoop. Go and bring peace to the world. Alright, let me drop back down into that um, well. Baked palm fruit. Oh, there you are. What am I doing? Let's buy more rice. Going back to Kakariko. Pretty much know the layout now. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, I will. Yeah. Rice. Now. Oh. Huh. Oh. Only fifteen. Oh. Yeah. 
I need more rice. Thinking. Rito Village is where I find wheat. I do need more wheat. Yes. Sell rice. We can do so. Arrows. I have 165. I'm fine. Um, Terry Town. I super misjudged. Highly and rice. Which place would sell highly and rice? Probably not Goron City, right? Shoot, I don't even see a shop around here. Oh, well, I guess I wouldn't. Okay, anyway. Oh, so Let's see. In armor shop, general store. Let's just let's try it. the armor shop i completely overshot it okay there it is i know the sign when i see it ah and i'm not at all surprised oh let me try Kakariko Village. No. Nope, nope. They're not gonna have it. Now that I think about it. Let's try Lookout Landing. Huh. <sighs> Yes, Lookout Landing sells Hylian rice. Oh. All of them. Only three? Ah. That's upsetting. <laughs> that is upsetting. Mm. Anyway. I'm worried about everyone back at home in Lurlin Village. I keep hoping they got away from the, from the pirates. Mm. Me too. We're so fortunate to have refu uh, refuge here. I can't say the same for everyone else. The village is way out on the edge of East Nekluda to the southeast, and there's nowhere, uh, nowhere nearby for them to run to. Mm. Rose is the village leader, so he'd be the first to know how things shook out back, uh, back home. But we've got no way to reach him. Never thought something like this would happen in our peaceful little hometown. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why are you staring at us, buddy? Are you a customer? Eh? You must have overheard the bad news, but enough about that. Well, see, the thing is, <gasps> the pirates are already gone? And Rosalind and everyone from the village are okay too? Oh. Thank goodness. I'm so glad they're all safe. I was beside myself. <laughs> Thank you for bringing us the best possible news. <laughs> Please have this as a sign of our gratitude. 
Mighty Salt Grilled Crab. Ooh. Mid level attack boost. 9 out of 10 fishermen agree. Crab is best enjoyed grilled and with just a bit of salt. Oh. That mighty salt grilled crab is my finest cooking. It's a dish that really brings out the warrior in you. Please enjoy. Mm. With the pirates gone, I have to wonder how our little shop back home is looking. It's bad. It's really bad. Even if I have to go, uh, go on my own, maybe I should return to Luralind Village. Oh. Even with the pirates out of the picture, there's work to be done. They're, they're going to be busy for a while rebuilding their houses and shops. Uh. Without any woodworking skills, you'd just get in the way if you went back now. Instead, we should focus on saving up money in the meantime. Uh. That way, once the village is restored, we'll have the means to reopen our shop there. Oh. You're right. Let's keep the business here rolling until the village is back to normal. Village attacked by pirates. Village attacked by pirates complete. All right. Hey, bring me my horse. Marble. Yeah, yeah, old codger. Oh, sorry. Let's take it a little slower. And bolt of lightning. Oh, it's a Goron. I made a simple hammer. Hey, don't it feel like the it's been one weird thing after another since the upheaval? The other day my precious hammer that that I've loved and cared for since well since forever just up and rotted. It was beyond fixing, so I slapped the rock onto a wooden stick and had me a new hammer. Uh. It might not be pretty, but it beats a rotten old hammer any day of the week. Ha. You're right. Ha. 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 You're right. Sorry. Ha. This way. Never let your guard down, even around weak enemies. I can tell you're an adept fighter. <laughs> it was destiny that brought us together here, and destiny that I give you this as thanks. Don't fight fate now. Ooh, what's this? Grants a low-level defense boost, simply simmer a pumpkin to make this dish. Oh, okay. A favorite in Kakariko. Ah. I'm still traveling the world in search of Misko's treasure. Ah. The rumors say there's a piece hidden in a cave around here. Mm. But I couldn't find it, so I think I'll head to my next destination. That's not to say I don't have time to chat, if if you're so inclined. Ah. Let's see. Why don't we talk about these CC-clad fashion enthusiasts? You must have seen them on the road. The folks wearing those adorable mushroom-themed outfits. Ah. Those outfits are high-end CC brand fashion, straight from Hatano Village in Nekluda. I guarantee you that anyone dressed like that is after Misko's treasure. Mm. To them, Misko's treasures represent the peak of fashion. And that has them searching high and low for any pieces they can find. <laughs> they're so excited about the whole thing that, there's, that they're always telling me the latest rumors about caves and treasures. So if you see someone dressed like that during your travels, you just strike, strike up a conversation. Ah. Thank you for keeping me company. That was a fun chat. See you around. Um, I already got the one near here, I guess. Yeah. This one near this stable. Hmm. But that's not what we're out here for. Let's go, Marvel. This way. Aha! Finally. Ah! Parga, hi there. Welcome to Rolling Pastures. Ah! Hey, you want to know a trick to take down monsters and wild animals easily? Use your bow and arrows and aim for the head. 
There you go. Easy elixirs and cooking ingredients. Th though, if you're cooking, you'll need vegetables Ooh. too. Now, how about sampling some of Hatenel's Hatenel Village's finest? I also sell Hatenel cheese. Ah. Oh man, oh, I, oh, ah, I thought for sure she had rice. I thought for sure she had rice. Ah, wasting my time. Wasting my time. Nothing. Ooh. Nothing. Ah. Yeah, yeah. Marble, meet me over at uh, New Serene Stable. Seren Stable. Sinakawak. Sinakawak. Let's see. What's in this issue of the Lucky Clover Gazette? What's the news? Beautiful city of water floods with joy at New King's Rise. Hmm. The sludge that worried so many Zora has vanished. In its wake, Prince Sidon, loyal servant, has ascended the throne. <laughs> it's really something to see a change in leadership for the Zora. They live such long lives. What a happy story. Mm. Other stories? Oh. oh, here's something. A great fairy has been spotted. Great fairy Terra has been seen recently perhaps enticed by the beautiful music of the stable trotters mm. if i remember right the great fairies are known to bestow their blessings upon travelers maybe i should seek one of the four sisters out and try to receive a blessing mm. <laughs> strange to think i can learn about world affairs just by reading the paper it seems like that big cold snap in hebrew is over Maybe I ought to take a little field trip to the Lucky Clover Gazette. It's not really much to look at right now. Pen, what are you doing here? Mm. A beast is rumored to be a mountain of a creature and has brutal tusks and has huge brutal tusks. We might have a real situation here if the princess really is controlling it. Oh. Well, for now, we need to gather more info. There was a visitor here talking about the sightings of the rumored beast in a subtropical region to the south. Hopefully you can pluck out some more details by checking in at stables. Oh, okay. Weapons, beasts. Beetle. Beetle, hey buddy. You don't have any Hylian rice, do you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, do Oh, wait, okay. Hey there, we meet again. Are you still moving forward on this little journey we call life? Ooh, do Beetle's eyes deceive him? Or is that a bladed rhino beetle? I have such a weakness for bladed rhino beetles. Will you give it to me, please? I think a mighty elixir is a fair trade. What do you say? Sure, take it. Attack up for five minutes. <laughs> ah, there's a... There, there's good in the world. I'm... I'm going to spend the day treating this beetle like royalty. And if you think I'm mushy, just wait until you see this beetle's excretions. Ew. So, well then. <laughs> Only if you have rice, dude. Uh, nothing. Sure, man. Uh, that was weird. That was gross, dude. Come on. I'm eating. I'm not eating. Yep, 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 uh -huh. yep. Give me my uh -huh. horse. Bring oh. me marble. Uh -huh. Nothing. Nothing. Oh. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Cool. Oh, right. Uh, down the road. Get on down, get on down the road. Alright. So... North Hyrule Plain Cave. Hey, guys. What, uh... What you looking at? Hmm. Uh, 
you. What's in here? Yep. Keg. Opal. What's in here? Yep. Take five, buddy. Ugh. It's staying. So that's it, huh? Aha! I see! Huh. What's in here? Climbing gear! That's what I've been looking for this entire time. Not really, but it's very nice to have it, finally! Okay. Let's try Hatano again. Yeah. Fine. 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 Yes, I could just cut down, like, grass and stuff looking for Hylian rice. Could. That seems like such a hassle. And so. Hey! Thanks for coming oh. in such bad weather. Welcome. I will want to stay. Melania bed! Oh. Yes, yes, yes. Um, I'll go. Uh, yeah, I'll go till morning, actually. Oh. Rest well. God of horses. I hunger for glazed veggies, a meal of fresh vegetables cooked in sweet coarser bee honey. Bring me the food I crave and I will enhance your horse's abilities. Veggies and coarser bee honey. Cool. When the glow of the blood-stained moon shines upon the land. Bear witness! And you guys are like, why does he keep saying bear witness? And I'm like, because <laughs> I think it's funny. I did hear a message. Yay, one point. One more point! Yeah. Ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Hat no. Tell me you have more rice in stock. 
please. Go right in. Yes. Yes. All of them. Cool. Ah, oh, finally. Jeez. Jeez, man. It's just gonna be raining everywhere today. You're right. Oh, not just any rain. Thunderstorms. Oh shit. Oh shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was sure close. <laughs> Energizing glazed veggies. Sweet. Let's go see. Bring me marble. Do it. Do it now. Nope. There you are. Let's go see Melania. All right, Melania. Oh, it's you. What brings you here? Choose a loyal steed to receive my blessings. Ah. Glazed veggies. So, okay, so when he gives me that dream, that it basically means nothing. <laughs> basically, it means nothing. Because I have to make multiples of these things in order to actually enhance abilities. All right. No. Sorry, Marble, I brought you out here for no reason. Cool, man. To Lurlin. Bolson. We're going to start by rebuilding the foundation of each of the buildings the monsters destroyed. See, when a building's central pillar is busted, you have to shore up the foundation, or it'll all come crashing down. Oh. And it's raining. Okay, so as far as logs go, I need 15 more. Think you can handle that? And when I say logs, I don't mean the kind that come from palm trees. 
I've got plans for those palm trees, okay? So make sure our logs come from other kinds of trees. And while you're at it, could you collect 20 bundles of Hylian rice so we can fix the thatched roofs that got, that got oh. torched? We're going to restore the, these charming buildings to their former glory. You and me, baby! Um, here's the rice. Maha. Whoa, just look at you go. I like the hustle. All that's left is to collect the logs. Just 15 more. Please and thank you. Oh. Oh. Uh, about the materials, oh. you can get yourself some logs by cutting down trees. But watch out, if you're carried away and cut the logs, well, then you've got nothing but wood, and that's no good. Hmm. I saw lots of gorgeous trees growing around the hills near the village entrance. Remember? Near the place where we were hiding out? I admit it's a bit of a hike. Sure, it sure would be nice if there was some way to carry the logs more easily. Hmm. I see, awesome. so you need log logs. If we restore the houses, the villagers who fled are sure to come flocking back. I just know it. We've come too far to turn back now. We're going to rebuild Luralin Village with our own four hands. Fifteen logs. Log logs. We're talking like... Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. 15 logs. Okay, time to put this axe to good use. Ha! Nice! One swing. Ugh. And four. Yeah! Five. Yeah. Yep. Break this way, please. Complete lotus seeds. Two. Three. Mm. Four more. Where am I going to see four? Okay. I wonder if. Um, that's too short. Okay, so Dude, the village is fine Ooh. Sebasto, it's not often that we see travelers here in such gloomy weather It's not so bad Then again, everyone has their reasons for going places It's not as though we ended up here by choice do you know Laurel and Village? We used to live there. 
It's a small fishing town. You'll see it if you go to southeast down this road and follow the signs. Hmm. No, it's not much to look at now after the monsters got to it. In the blink of an eye. Uh, in the blink of an eye, they ruined the whole village. The restaurant my wife had just opened. Our house. Everything. Gone. They just came cr cruising in on their boat like a bunch of pirates. So that's what we're calling them. Pirates. If you're going to the coast, be careful. You don't want them to spot you. What? Okay, sir. Guess I'm not going to tell you that the village is safe. Mm. The rain doesn't mess around here. And if, you're he and if you hear thunder, watch out. <sighs> Glad as I am that we got out of Lurland Village, our food supplies here are running out. If only those pirates were gone and my restaurant was rebuilt, we could return to the village and eat a, raw, a real meal. Yep, my place was famous for serving up food folks, a food folks had never tried. Ah. No use dwelling on that. I need to decide tonight's menu. I forgot that Bolson construct, um, Hudson Construction has some construction materials here. I just wish I had marble with me. <laughs> Oops. Oh, you know what? Let me see. Let me think. Yes, that. Mm. Can't really use a smaller piece, right? Oh, I guess I could. Nah, it's fine. Let me just toss that there. Okay, so now it's on wheels. Look out. Look out, little boy. I can't attach anymore. How dare you? Concern it. Oh, fine. Let's try this. Oh, my goodness. That wasn't going to work anyway. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Wood is just too heavy. Fine, I'll just walk it. Ugh. For all that time. Ugh. Nothing to show for it. Ugh. I could just drop it off the cliff, right? The wood's not going to bust up. Ah, uh, oh. Now that's working with physics. Oops. 
I smell high quality lumber. Oh. Well, well, well. You got right to work gathering logs, I see. May I? Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Seeing someone work so hard and knowing so little sleep, it warms my heart. Thank you. I'll be glad to take good care of this. Thanks for getting after the, those logs. That makes 15 in our collection. Oh, well, you look at that. What a haul. Thanks a lot, pal. Now we have enough logs to make the repairs. Time to start rebuilding those buildings. Mm. First thing I've got to do is use those logs you collected to shore up the foundations under the buildings. So hold tight for just a bit, okay? Oh, the giant ship is gone. I'll do the foundation work and check the state of the buildings while I'm at it. I'll be back before you know it. <laughs> okay, do. Sorry for the wait. I don't see any change. Oh, okay. The foundations are nice and solid. Now it's time to move on to repairing the buildings. What do you need? Oh. There are five buildings that need fixing. Three of them are establishments. The inn, the restaurant, and the lucky treasure shop. And two of them are homes. The village head's house and arms homes. The repair process will depend on the building we're working on, so I'll explain once you decide where we start. Mohawk. Now we're getting to the real meat of the Great Lurlin Revival, uh, Village Revival. So, which building should we get to work on? To, should we get to work on? Bleh. Um, an establishment. Mm. An establishment it is. Which one should we get to work on? Um... Let's do the restaurant. Oh. We're rebuilding the restaurant, are we? Mm. The restaurant is over there. Azure Bay is known for its incredible cuisine, you know. They offer dishes from all over the world. Mm. How about we relocate to the restaurant so I can do a better job explaining the work we need to do. Let's go. <laughs> Okie do. Please follow me. Oh. All right, here we are. Hmm. The center pillar is broken and we have to fix it pronto. After all, it provides vital support to the whole building. I already used the logs you collected to shore up the foundation, so... Oh. See that building over there? Sure. We can use a log from a palm tree to support this building the same way. Then we'll be set. See the holes in the roof and the floor? They are a perfect fit for a log. All we need to do is put the log through them. Mm. Even though we can easily score a log from a palm tree growing nearby, I don't have a clue how we're going to insert that log through the holes in the roof and, and the floor. Why didn't you build around the palm tree? Cut down the tree, put the log in be uh, in the middle, and then build around that. I thought you were a master con um, master builder, master constructor. <laughs> I mean, we have to pick a palm tree that's straight as an arrow. That much I know. Mm -hmm. But the rest is a real head scratcher. We'll use that one. That one should be fine. All right, so we've got to get. A tree. Ah, no, Link. Alright, so we're just gonna move this. Yep. And we'll use this tree. I have an axe, right? Yep, here we go. One swing! Oh boy. Uh, uh, let's attach this so it stays upright. <clears throat> Take it and shake it off. Ugh.
<laughs> Ooh, almost. There it is. Oh, it's perfect. I couldn't have found a better pillar to hold this place up myself. Just leave the rest to me. I'm on it. Bolson, da da da, Bolson, hua hua, ua ua, Bolson, da da da, Bolson, sha 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 ding. Okay, do all done. Ooh. Looking nice. Get a load of my handiwork. Talk about a perfect restoration job. The old building skills are still sharp as nails, baby. Now all we have to do is wait for the owner to return and... Ooh. Sebasto! Am I dreaming? Uh. Wow! But it was all broken before. Wah. Look, Zuta, our house. It's all better, too. Ooh. I just came to check on my restaurant and my house. I was so worried about them. Was... Was it you? Did you fix them? Ooh. And I helped. Thank you so much. Please, I want you to have this. Tough seafood fried rice. I had this in the last game, I think. Stirring the flame, the taste of the dish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Of all the dishes we serve in our restaurant, this is the one I'm most proud of. Please stop by anytime you're hungry. I'll treat you to meals the likes of which you've never tasted before. As of now, Azure Bay is open for business. Huzzah! Huh? Hey, hey! This is no time for resting on laurels. There's work to do, and it ain't doing itself. Stupid cord. Yeah. Look, you and me, we're beasts of construction. We'll have this village back, uh, put back together in no time. So what's next? This is my first big job in a while, and I admit I'm absolutely thrilled to be getting back to it. Now, which building should we work some magic on? Uh, an establishment. Oh. Um, let's do... The Lucky Treasure Shop. Mm. We're building the Lucky Treasure Shop, are we? Oh. That one. Whoa. The Lucky Treasure Shop is over there. It's a charming spot that beguiles travelers with a treasure game that, rumor has it, no one ever loses. Really? Mm. How about we head to the Lucky Treasure Shop so I can explain what we need to do to fix that baby up? Let's go. <laughs> okay, do. Please follow me. Oh. All right, here we are. Hmm. The palm tree grew through the roof of, up on the second story. It was a bit of a landmark, actually. But, well, the damage is worse than I thought. I rebuilt the foundation using the logs you collected for me. Hmm. But this building is so big that rather than connecting the roof, to, uh, the roof and the floor, the palm tree logs should go in the plant pot on the second floor and then through the hole in the roof. Oh. When it comes to selecting a good palm tree log, make sure you get yourself a straight one, okay? You and me, let's return these places to their former glory. Nice and straight. Well, we're going for nice and straight. Doesn't get much, much nicer and straighter than this one. Hey! Okay. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Nope. Okay. No link. Yeah. There we go. 
It's perfect. I couldn't have found a better pillar to hold this place up myself. Just leave the rest to me. I'm on it. This is going to be easy, actually. Okie do. All done. Treasure. Yes, it's perfecto. It's the biggest building in this village, so returning it to its former glory wasn't easy, but the owner is going to love it. Oh? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What exactly is going on here? I was sure the monsters had done my shop in. Oh. I heard the pirates were gone and came running. I can't believe I can open my shop again. I never thought this day would come. Ah. This place means everything to me. My old man, rest his soul, left it to me. Here, please, I have to thank you. Take this. Bump flowers. <laughs> I picked several of them while I was hiding out. I was planning to throw them at the pirates, but there's no need for that now. Because of you, the lucky treasure shop is back in business. <laughs> in fact, you don't even need rupees. You can be broke and still come on in and try your luck. Doors are open starting now. Oh. Hey, hey, this is no time for resting on laurels. There's work to do, and it ain't doing itself. Look, you and me, we're beasts. Let's do this thing. Uh, you're thrilled. Now let's do a home. Mm. We're building a house, are we? Well, which, which house is the lucky one? Um, the village head's house. Oh. We're rebuilding the house for the head of the village, are we? Way over there. The house is there. That there is where the village head and his family live. They've been letting me stay letting me stay with them too. Ugh, it was so cozy. They even had a little something for Princess Zelda uh, from Princess Zelda on display. Then along came those awful monsters. Mm. How about we head over there so I can explain what we need to need to do to fix the place up. Let's go! Oh. All right, here we are. Hmm. The central pillar is broken, so we have to repair it. Pronto. I already shored up the building's foundation using the logs you collected for me. So if we can place a log from a palm tree through the holes in the roof and floor like I mentioned, that should do it. Oh. When you pick a palm tree, just make sure it's a straight one. You and me, pal, let's return these places to their former glory. Man, this is a lot easier than I thought it would be. <laughs> All right. Hey! Oh, too close, too close. Sorry about that, sir. There it is. Ma. It's perfect. I couldn't have found a better pillar to hold this place up myself. Just leave the rest to me. I'm on it. This is easier than when I helped build Terrytown. <laughs> All I have to do is put the logs in. <laughs> All done. Mm -hmm. It's all done. From here on out, I'll have a comfy place to sleep at night. Ah. Oh, I thought I heard the sound of hammering coming from the house. It's exactly how it was before. Ah. Luckily, the house's main building went undamaged, but the detached hut where Bolson was staying was destroyed. I was so worried about finding a place for him to sleep, but not anymore. Mm. Sorry you had to go to the trouble of fixing up our house. 
Here, I'd like to give you something for the repairs. Borgie! Uh-huh. It's the tastiest fish you can catch around here. Grill it, stew it, whatever you like. It's always delicious. There was a picture from Princess Zelda on display in the detached hat. Quick, let's make sure it's not damaged. Oh. No time for resting on laurels. There's more work to do. We're beasts of construction. Let's put this village back together. Oh, oh, cool. You want to hear something pathetic? During the whole pirate raid, I was holed up in my house, hiding. After the excavation, I snuck back to grab a change of clothes. But before I knew it, there were pirates outside, so I had no choice but to hunker down and pray they didn't find me. It's not for you. If not for you, they probably would have demolished my house with me in it. You saved my life, and you helped me come to an important realization. Mm. An outfit isn't worth risking your life for, no matter how good it makes your legs look. Good for you. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad you learned a lesson. I'm thrilled. This is my first job. I'm so excited. Now it's building a home. Arms House is the only one that still needs fixing. Way oh. over there. <laughs> I recall Arms said he wanted a spot outside to display his biggest catches. Mm. Why don't we relocate to Arms House for a bit? It'll be easier for me to explain what we need to do. Let's go. Oh. Fo please follow me. Oh. All right, here we are. <laughs> the central pillar is broken, as they always are, so we have to repair it pronto. I already shored up the building's foundation using the logs you collected for me. So if we can place a log from a palm tree, from a palm tree through the holes in the roof and floor, like I mentioned, that should do it. Oh. Pick one that's straight. You and me, pal. Let's return these places to their former glory. Hey! Oop. Thread the needle. Oh. Oh? Oh, I didn't thread the needle. <laughs> thread the needle. Ah, there it is. Oh, it's perfect. I couldn't have found a better pillar to hold this place up myself. Just leave the rest to me. I'm on it. <laughs> ooh what? ooh what? sha 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 ding <laughs> <laughs> All done. Mm -hmm. Ha ha ha! Behold! What you see before you is the work of a true craftsman! Mm -hmm. Oh! My house is fixed! You really fixed it! Thank you! I can finally get back to making a living! I'm really sorry I wasn't any help. Please take this as a kind of apology. Oh, 50 bucks! Oh, I'm kind of low on money, aren't I? Now I can go fishing again. You know, I don't need very many fish to feed myself, so I share the extras I catch with other folks. <laughs> I usually save them for the people here in the village, but I really owe you for fixing my house. If I have extras to share, I'll put them in front of my house. Please take whatever you need. Oh, that's very kind of you. Oh. Thanks. Hey, hey, no laurel resting. There's more work to do. We're beasts. And we have to put this village back together. Box. Five bucks. All right, one more establishment. The inn is the only one that still needs fixing. Way over there. Mm. 
Oh, uh, it's the middle of the town. Okay. The inn is over there. It's known far and wide for its salt spa. They use herbs and whatnot to soothe travelers' sore and weary muscles. Mm. Let's move over to the inn so I can do a better job explaining what we need to do. Okay? Let's go. Please follow me. Follow me! Oh. All right, here we are. Mm. As you can see, the frame and the central pillar managed to hold up just fine. But if you look inside, you'll see there's a puddle of rainwater. Getting rid of the water won't be difficult, but that junk in there is, is a hazard and will make it impossible for me to work. Mm. I don't want to damage the framing, since we're lucky it's intact, but I'm not sure how to get rid of that debris. It won't be easy, but I think we're going to have to pull it out piece by piece from above. Mm -hmm. Once all that junk is gone, I'll start the rebuilding work right away. It will look incredible! Time for the final phase. I can stand on this, right? Okay. by piece you say no all at once well well I'm getting something uh, I'm betting someone got rid of all that junk that someone is you by the way just leave the rest to me I'm on it shasha <laughs> ding <laughs> All done. Baba. Restored to its former glory. Some of my finest work, if I do say so myself. The owner can move back in any old time. Jessica. Oh, excuse me. What is going on? I thought the pirates destroyed my place. But here it is, good as new. Ma. Oh. You two rebuilt it, didn't you? I was hiding out in the Gerudo region in the southwest. Oh, wow, all the way out there. But it's just sand as far as the eye can see. I missed the ocean so much I had to come back. And then I found this. I can't believe my inn is all fixed up. I'm stunned. Ah, oh. uh, I'm sorry. I really must give you a thank you gift. Well, fruits, neat. <laughs> I brought this back as a little treat for everyone. Please, come on by and enjoy our famous salt spa. No time to waste. The inn is open for business as of today. Huh? Bolson, is it true? Oh. You bet it is. Every last building in the village is built as good as new. <laughs> Incredible! How can I ever thank you? And to think you restored the village so quickly. A feast is most certainly in order tonight. Whoa! Did you hear that? A feast! He said a feast is in order! Oh dear, you think I should change my outfit? Nah, you look fine. The day the pirates attacked and overran the village, I was desperate to get everyone to safety. Before I knew it, our beloved home was gone. After everyone fled, 
The only sound coming from Lurlan village was the sound of monsters. I had never thought, never dared to dream. I'd live to see the day we could all laugh together again like this. Oh. This moment right now, it's all thanks to you. Of course, I'm extremely grateful to Bolson as well. Oh. No, no. There's no need to thank me. After all, when I first drifted into this village, you all welcomed me with open arms, didn't you? The work I did here oh. is... Oh, wow, you just skipped right past that. The work I did here is just my way of paying that kindness back. Bolson, thank you. This village owes you a debt. In fact, I think it's safe to say that you are this village's savior. Oh. Now, I talked about this with the rest of the folks around here, and we do not have enough money or treasure to repay you for saving our home. Oh. But the treasure we do have, well, it's this village and everyone in it. So from now on, we'll do everything we can to share our hospitality with you. For the village's savior, I'll provide a bed for free anytime. Ah. You are also welcome to eat at the restaurant as much as you like, free of charge, of course. Ah. The village's savior may not need to test his luck, but I'm sure it'd be fun to play the a treasure chest game once in a while. Oh. Please, feel free to take anything you find in the village. Oh, I'm awash with emotions. I can't hold back anymore. Oh. Zutar, Kinov. Oh. Look lively. It's time for the... As the bolson dance, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Lurlin Revival da -da Dance. Sure. I guess that's catching on with the kitties. <laughs> Learn and Village Restoration Project complete! You can stay for free. I've got a free bed here. Neat. What about the salt spa? Uh, I don't need it. I'll come back when I lose more hearts. Well, this is awesome. Good stuff, good stuff. Um, uh, probably nothing, right? I guess it sank. Hey, it's the guy who fixed our house. Uh, that was more bolson, but whatever. Being in a tent was kind of fun, like having a secret base, but I'm way happier now we're back home. <laughs> you know, mister, everyone's calling you the savior of our village. That's because I am. Thanks for putting everything back how it used to be. Aww. Sorry, mister, but I can't play right now. I gotta find my dad's blue shirt. Blue shirt? Aww. It's dad's favorite thing. He loves it so much, he put it in an iron chest so nobody take it. But I checked everywhere and I couldn't find the chest. I think those pirates sank it, so it's probably in the bay, since it's too heavy to float away. Oh. Dad's pretending like he doesn't mind, but I bet he's really sad it's gone. I gotta get it back. Dad's blue shirt. Well, I certainly don't see nothing, but I'll go out and... Oh, well, I mean, I see a couple things. This is likely not it. Ha <laughs> It's blue. Boom. It's blue. <laughs> Let's see. It's 
That bird's having fun. <laughs> I keep pressing bad buttons. All right. This one. Darn it. this island lobster shirt a soft comfortable shirt traditional to southern island it's made of breathable fabric so it's well suited to warm regions it offers heat resistance that's interesting all right i could just swim back can float back. We've run aground! No huh? boy! Where's that iron chest with Dad's blue shirt? It's heavy, so if it sank in the ocean, it should still be in the bay somewhere. Dad's pretending like he doesn't mind, but I bet he's really sad it's gone. I gotta get it back. Huh? You smell like my dad, mister. Ugh, weird. Maybe you... Did you find my dad's blue shirt? Here you go. Uh -huh. That color. That smell that sticks in my nose. There's no mistaking it. This is dad's blue shirt. <laughs> Thank you, mister. I gotta go tell my dad. Oi! Dad! This guy found your shirt, Dad. Oh. It smells like you. <laughs> so that's what you two were doing on the beach all day. Looking for this? I thought you were out playing. Gosh. Thanks for fighting this, guys. Oh. And you, saving villages, finding lost items. What can't you do? My trusty blue shirt. When I was a young man, I used to wear it all the time. But I haven't put it on since the boy's mom since the boy's mom started picking out my clothes. Seems a shame to keep that beauty in the moldy old chest, though. Say, would you want it? Oh sure. I'm gonna jump in the river real quick to wash it, cause I don't want your stench on it. But yeah, I'll take it. Uh. What? But Dad, weren't you sad about your shirt? Mm. Well, yeah. The one I'm wearing. I was eating soup and I got a big stain on it. I thought it was ruined, Ugh. but then mommy got rid of the stain, so it's good as new. <laughs> oh, so all this time we were worried about the wrong shirt? Wah. Wrong shirt, wrong shirt. <laughs> Afraid so, kiddo, but I am grateful that uh, you did all that for your old man. Honestly, I can't believe how fast you two are growing up. <laughs> you make your dad proud, you know that? Very, very proud. He's proud. Very, very proud. All right, sweet. Let's go wash this stench off. I wasn't kidding. <laughs> Is this doing anything? No, but I feel like I had to. Ah, better. I like it. Nope. Nope. 
Kind of? Nah. Ember trousers. Terrible. Anyway, <laughs> cool. Highly in trousers. All right, cool. Nice and cool. A new attraction, eh? All right, last one. Hi. Hey, now, what's on your mind? You're thinking about teaming up with your pal Bolson again, aren't you? Whoa, I've read that weird. Anyway, I'm not surprised. Our chemistry is out of this world, yeah? Funny thing is, I was just talking to the mayor about creating some kind of new attraction in Luralin. Hmm. Yes, I'd like, I'd like it to be some kind of entertainment, something everyone could really get behind and enjoy. Hmm. You've traveled all over the place, haven't you? Any marvelous ideas you care to share? Hmm. And you say some kind of entertainment, huh? Offer underwater tours. <laughs> Host a water rally. Open a floating hotel. Host a water rally. Host a water rally. A, 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 a rally race. On the water? Cle clever. Very clever. Don't you think? Oh. Hmm. Well, it would be a brand new form of water-related amusement. <laughs> that could do the trick. Yes. In fact, I think that's it. Oh. I seem to recall Hudson saying something about inviting some hotshot professional racers to help develop some new vehicle. If we could work with them... Oh. Hudson? Do you mean the fellow from that Terrytown place in northeastern Akala? I'd love to invite the racers here once they finish their work there. Though I do wonder if real professional racers will be willing to come to a place like this. Okay, I said one more and I meant it. I don't think I'm going to finish that quest. It's time to move on. And you're either like, aw, come on, or good, get out of here. And I'm like, I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving, okay? I swear I'm leaving. Time to go after that um, geoglyph. 